It's not on the counter yet, but it will be. So we're still in that let it get essentially worse before it gets better kind of uh, motif going on. But we got a floor now. It was clean, but then I moved stuff and now it's not. But it exists. It's not perfect, but it's so much better than not having a floor. I'm gonna put a piece of trim there because it bothers me. Ah, but the major victory of tonight, shank. Da -na 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 -na. Sink. Uh, that's probably ridiculous, but I haven't hooked it up. I haven't put the pipes in. Still got to tile that counter. Still got to nail that counter down. Ran out of battery on the Dremel, trying to cut the hole for the espresso machine. Figured that was as good a time as any to call it a day. Made some adjustments underneath. There were those two big filters on the same side as the sink. But because I have a somewhat bigger sink going in, I'm just going to move their brackets. There's two brackets back there. I'm gonna move those brackets over here and just get some longer pipe and they'll be closer to the espresso machine anyway because you should use filtered water for espresso machines. Um, I mostly have been posting photos and now I'm not sure where I'm at with stuff. Oh, huh, still don't have a hallway light. So I painted to this point because we're going to be putting up a curtain anyway to block the heat going to the basement while we're remodeling the basement. And also I didn't figure that area was super duper safe to be painting by myself in the middle of the night. Um, still got to put the trim up in the bathroom. I started framing the window and I have stuff to finish framing the window. I'm going to be staining it all that nice dark color. Um, same with, I'm gonna do all the trim in here, that dark color, maybe even the door. I just think it would look nice. Uh, we got this toilet. In spite my love of using old things, using an old toilet became completely impractical. So I ended up with a newer toilet. And then also, as you have probably observed, funkiness. Well, the pipe to this toilet is a little bit too close to the wall and a little bit too high. So barring an ability to move the pipe, which just isn't practical right now, I made the floor higher, which is what's going on with that. And then we made the wall further away, <laughs> which is probably not what you're really supposed to do and it probably won't be a forever solution, but it was for now the solution. And I took a piece of the siding that was downstairs and just painted it to match. And I took some trim that was downstairs and framed it because what you're gonna do with weird scraggly drywall besides frame it. Um, so I'm really happy with these colors in here. They're gonna really spruce up when we finish the trim because it'll just get clean cut looking really fast. And then I'm not sure about the cupboards. I kind of want to paint them this color, but I'm not sure I have enough of that color. So they might have to be a different color or they might have to just be wood because right now they're wood and that could be okay. Um, yeah, so. It is definitely better than the bare plywood. I'm, I'm very happy about it not being bare plywood anymore. And I'm very happy about not completely destroying this counter when I cut this hole for the sink with probably really the wrong sauce tonight. But when I tile over it, you won't be able to tell. So tomorrow I have to drill holes and get really long screws, tack that down, hook up my sink, finish drilling that hole, and uh, recheck the internet for how to tile a counter, because this counter is the only thing standing in between Union Center and the espresso machine that's waiting for us in the hills, which, anyway, really excited about it. So, that is my update. I've been a little overdue because I've been working a lot with the little man in here and I do not like him in my videos. So, oh, also, this. Very happy to find a cuttable, trim piece that could go between the floors. I might stain it and I might put extra screws in it, but most of them were metal and I was getting like 
I don't want to deal with cutting it. And I found this and it just looks really good, I think, compared to nothing. That's what I'm up against. Compared to nothing, doing so much better. And the other counter that's going to replace the gray counter, in case any of you remember the gray counter, um, which is now featured at Rummage uh, down the road, um, is uh, an old counter from the old church that was downstairs that will fit great and it will just be a nice little rectangular counter. Um, more the style of the little country stores down here, I think. So that is the update. We are trucking along. My unofficial goal is I really want the espresso machine in this week, but I have been met with hang up after hang up, so I'm making no time commitments anymore. All right. Soon, though. Soon is still accurate. That's why I committed to soon. So, we will catch you later.